大家好，朋友们，我叫 Christian McJerry Keller， 我的中文名字是马菲娜，我是新西兰人，我的家庭在家，在 Palmerston North， 可是现在我住在中国，我的大学在中国，啊、um, ，是昆山杜克大学。I started learning Chinese about one year ago when I first came to China,、um, go to university in China to、uh, Duke Kunshan University, which is like a joint venture university between Duke University in the US and Wuhan University in China. So that's when I started learning Chinese because it's compulsory for all freshman students、um, who are international like me. So the best thing for me about learning Chinese is that because I'm in China, it's very useful to learn Chinese.、Um, and beside the actual like practical use of just being able to order food that's vegetarian, or being able to、um, like talk to people and like order clothes and、um, everything that you need to do to live in China,、um, it's really great to be able to connect to people. It's like even with my basic Chinese, I'm able to connect with like. Of millions of other people that I would never have been able to connect to if I didn't know Chinese. If I hadn't put like that little bit of effort in to learn it,、um, I would say do it. It's very important in the coming years, I think, to be able to have a second language. In New Zealand, we're kind of an isolated, or an island. We're isolated from a lot from the rest of the world, and we don't realize that. Most of the world is like mono is not monolingual. They speak many different languages, and it's actually、um, very important to be able to communicate with different peoples around the world.、And、Chinese, in particular, is going to be really important, obviously, as China rises, as it is rising, to be like a bit like the strongest global power in the world. To be able to successfully interact with、um, Chinese culture on Chinese terms will be very. Important, I think, for New Zealanders and for New Zealand ties with China as they grow. No, I think I think New Zealand would be a, a lot better place if everyone could、um, speak a second language. I think a better question for my particular context is to talk a little bit about the opportunity of learning Chinese, because、um, for me, living,、um, being able to go to China and learn Chinese is like one of the greatest opportunities I've ever had. As well as like being able to study at the university that、um, I'm currently studying at, in the future it's going to be so useful to me.、Um, I have、uh, a lot of、um, a lot of older mentors and、um, people who are involved in like politics and like international relations、um, always tell me the value of learning Chinese, especially for a New Zealander, because、um, there's just so few people that actually learn the language.、Um. When I travel to different places in China, which I've had the opportunity to do because I've been living in China,、um, I'm able to talk to people a lot more, and I'm able to connect with people. And、um, when I travel to visit my、um, Chinese friends' families, like I can talk to their parents or I can talk to their sisters, and I'm not just like this island in like a sea of like Chinese culture that's just、uh, unavailable to me. Like I can,、um, I can really like get into it a little bit more. My favorite Chinese phrase is not particularly creative, but I'm going to stick by it anyway because I am loyal. My favorite Chinese phrase is one、um, I use a lot of the time. It's "su de chow mian." It's the way I order the favorite thing I like to eat in China, which is vegetarian fried noodles. <laughs> And it's probably incorrect Chinese. I don't know, but it's my favorite thing to say because it brings me a lovely hot steaming plate of fried noodles, and it's straight magic every time. I could eat those all day and all night for the entire year.